Welcome back to your Friday rant. This is Austin Lenny. Man, I tell you what, one of my favorite things to do, one of the favorite sayings I ever heard is, I'm going to show up after I show up. How many of us are not showing up to life? How many of us are not showing up in the moments that matter because emotionally we are not prepared health-wise, we're not prepared mentally, we're not prepared. We haven't thought of, I don't know, if I don't eat right, I don't take care of myself, I'm going to show up with low energy and I'm going to show up in a place where emotionally I can't make a decision necessary. Look, as I get higher up and I've, I've given over the CEO reins and now I'm the president and I'm more a strategic person and a branding and an acquisition and a hirer, people pay me for my judgment and my decisions. That's what my job is. And I had a good friend tell me that there's a thousand decisions that are made in your business daily. You're making six decisions a year and those decisions are bigger than the 12,000 decisions that'll be made because they move the business, they move the needle. And I got to thinking about that. If I am not healthy, if I don't have a clear mind, if I don't know where we're headed, then I'm going to make an emotional decision that's going to affect many people's jobs. And so when the spotlight's on, when the moment is necessary to make that decision, are you going to show up as the best version of yourself? Rested, healthy, blessed, clear, emotionally stable? Or are you going to make a knee-jerk decision because you haven't ate right? You're unhealthy. You feel tired. Guys, you're optimizing, create your life based on like an athlete who's showing up on Sunday for the big game. You're practicing all week to make that decision. And when it's game time, when the spotlight's on, it's time to go. It's not time to wither away in the moment. But the only way to show up in the best part of you is to be healthy, happy, and clear on your what you're after. Is to understand the whole play, to understand where you're going. How is this decision now going to affect my decision three years from now? A decision that you make now in your business, you won't actually feel for six months. So if you make a bad decision, now you've wasted six months. You showing up for yourself in the gym is not going to show up tomorrow, but a year from now, six months from now, it's going to show and how you feel. Everybody wants the short-term feedback, but the higher you get in business, the feedback loop gets longer. And so you have to show up daily without getting the validation of the feedback. And that's the rub. So if you're not clear on what the actual outcome you're seeking is, you're going to emotionally not be able to show up. Hope I've got some value from this, and we'll see you next time. Guys, let me take a minute to tell you about my buddies over at Lead Hub, Ben and Aaron, the best humans I know. Not only are they amazing at marketing for trade companies, but Ben started his HVAC company in his garage, sold it for multi-million dollars. So when this guy talks, I listen. When we took over Deets Mechanical, we had 22 reviews in 22 years in seven short months. We went from 22 reviews to 107 we went from a 4.2 to a 4.7. We tripled our Facebook presence and we tripled our calls. If you're an HVAC, plumbing, electric, landscaping company, and you're looking for a no BS approach to marketing, you're looking for people who have done it before, you got to go to leadhub.net 